So is the G20 very clearly split wide open? Um, Ambassador, Ambassador Sony, uh, this is a grouping that was meant for economic development. It's now become uh, a political or a diplomatic uh, boxing ring? Well, it is obvious that the split has taken place. But whether it's going to be permanent or is it just a, a, a temporary situation, as of now, it doesn't look temporary. But it has to be brought home. The point has to be brought home to both sides. I mean, amount of uh, aid which was earlier given by the Western countries on the one side and by the, by the Russians and the Chinese to the African countries and those in Asia. So both of them are affected. I mean, China's uh, uh, obligations have also gre uh, uh, grown, gone up so much because of the, you know, what is happening in our neighborhood, see uh, Pakistan, see Sri Lanka. So that crisis is something which is going to affect not just the Western countries, but also the, to, to, the, to the Chinese and the Russians. So we have to come, convey the message across that it is nobody's interest. It's not in the interest of the developing world. It's not the interest of the south, southern world. It's not in the interest either of the developed world and also the Chinese world. So the message has to be given, and, and India is the only country whose voice will be listened, is that let aside set aside your current differences, let's get to the real issues involved, and we, uh, as it was mentioned earlier, that those issues which divide us can be set aside at a later stage, and then we will deal with that. But that's a message that India has been constantly giving Ambassador Shankar. Uh, that message, neither America, nor Europe, nor Russia and China seem to be getting that message. Are we looking at this very dangerous hardening of stance and is this then becoming Cold War 2.0? Well, this is, there is a hardening of stance because, you know, with a Russian offensive due to take place in Ukraine and Ukraine being armed with the more sophisticated weapons and likely to have its own uh, offensive, uh, the conflict looks set to intensify over the next couple of months. But uh, uh, clearly, I think in diplomacy, uh, we are used to patience and perseverance. And both are required at this stage, along with skill, to try to keep the focus on issues which are important. As Ambassador Soni said, you know, there's a quite some time till the summit. There'll be many other meetings. And hopefully by then, we will be able to find a way to hammer out some consensus. So let's- Very, very, very good advice, ma'am. I hope that better sense prevails.